Oh god, my mouth is moving. What the? F Hello, people, and welcome to VR Chat. Yes, VR Chat. We're playing VR Chat today. So we're actually in the spectacular Spider Lair, and uh, you can probably imagine what we're going to be doing. We're going to be doing this friggin' web slinging today. So this actually came to my attention this morning. A VR YouTuber that I watch called uh, Game Attack VR. You might have heard of him. He actually uploaded a video about this, and I had no friggin' clue that this existed. And frankly, I'm kind of upset because as a Spider-Man fan, this shit looks awesome. So I did see that you can actually get some uh, get some cool looking Spider-Man avatars. So we will be going to get some of those. So let's just have a look around, shall we? Okay. Oh, here we go. This is where we pick our avatar. This looks sick. Oh, you can do Japanese Spider-Man. Yeah, let's go. Spider-Man. Oh, let's just go back upstairs. Whoa. <laughs> This is so cool. This actually looks a lot like the uh, the Japanese Spider-Man outfit. I mean, besides the yellow eyes, I'm pretty sure Japanese Spider-Man has white eyes, but it's still really cool nonetheless. Ooh, I love my boy 2099. Let's see. Oh yeah, that looks cool. You know what? I see people getting triggered about how uh, technically the uh, Spider-Man 2099 he has a black and red suit. Uh. You know what? This. Like blue and blue and red color scheme looks way better than black and red in my opinion. That's just my opinion though, don't kill me please. But I will be picking the Tasm 1 costume today because you know what, I'm not ashamed to admit it. The Tasm 1 costume is one of, if not my favorite, okay they f***ed up the gloves but it doesn't matter. Tasm 1 costume is one of, if not my favorite costume that Spider-Man has ever had. And uh, yeah, I just really like it. I actually bought a replica of the costume for a video that's coming up, Hunt the Best Spider-Man VR Game. And uh, yeah, you should subscribe if you want to see that. Actually, how does the Sam Raimi suit look? Oh yeah, this looks cool. Okay, I think we'll use this one instead. I do love the Tasm 1 costume, but no offense to the map creators, I don't really like how they've done this, like that version of the costume in this, but it's okay. So let's go do some web swinging. Go web! Fly! Oh. Yeah, let's go. I love that it makes the Tasm 1 web shooter sound effect as well. That is so good. Well, let's put away our web shooters for now. we got to find somewhere to jump up from. Oh, oh okay. Here we go. Oh. oh, this is awesome. Yeah, I am going to suck at this pretty bad. You know, it seems like my left web shooter is a little bit... Oh, okay, it just doesn't shoot out a beam. I'm well, not a beam, a web, unless you actually connect it with something. Whoa! Oh, that was awesome. Oh! Yeah! Ow. Oh, shit! Oh! Holy shit! Ah, Spider-Man throws. All right, we're going to use a combination of our web skills and our climbing and jumping skills here. What the frig? Jump! This is awesome, dude. Okay, I'm going to jump off and then grab our webs. Okay, well, that didn't work. Oh, yeah, only only recommendation that I would make is that I'm able to see my webs when I shoot them out and not just like only when they connect. Oh, should this, this should give us like a little head start in terms of swinging, so let's go. Holy crap, yeah. Oh. And the great thing about all these uh, these sort of web swinging games, it, there's always a skill curve to them. You know, it's not always just jump in and play. I mean, maybe with the Spider-Man Far From Home VR experience, but with the other games that you find, they, they actually have a lot of like a high skill ceiling, but at the same time, a low bar for entry so that anyone can play. And of course, who doesn't want to be Spider-Man? I mean, come on now. I think it's like every single child's dream to be Spider-Man in some capacity. You know, even though it can be kind of hard to just gain momentum, 
straight off the bat. It's definitely more realistic and I can appreciate that, I guess. It's certainly got like the best physics out of any Spider-Man game that I've played. Oh, God, this is literally going to make me sick. Speed boost. There we go. That time we cleared it. Let's... Oh, you know, the physics on this are actually pretty good, too. Oh, shit. Oh, oh my God. I'm going to be sick if I play this for any longer. Right, let's hit the loop. Whoa. That was sick, but also literally sick. I think I'm going to be... That was pretty fun. That was pretty cool. And I'll definitely be including this in my uh, the Hunt for the Best Spider-Man VR game because this is this is really f***ing cool. I mean, like, you got the skins, you got the uh, the wall crawling and everything. And, of course, you got the web shooters. And the web shooters have actually good physics. It's insane. So, yeah. This will definitely be included in that video. Subscribe if you want to see that. Help me, get to my, help me achieve my goal of uh, 200 subscribers before the end of this year. I would really appreciate that. So yeah, thank you for watching and bye-bye.